A sojourn through time takes us to the golden age of Islam, a period spanning five centuries from the 8th to the 13th. This was an era of striking cultural, scientific and economic blooming within Islamic civilization, a time when human knowledge took a quantum leap forward. Picture this, scholars like Al-Razi, Ibn Sina and Al-Biruni making significant strides in science and medicine, their works shaping the course of these disciplines, ancient texts from Greek, Roman and Indian civilizations being meticulously preserved and translated in the House of Wisdom Baghdad. Then there's the revolution in mathematics. Islamic mathematicians, spearheaded by the likes of Al-Khwarizmi, birthed algebra, introduced the decimal system with the concept of zero and advanced trigonometry. Buildings of breathtaking beauty like the Alhambra and the Dome of the Rock were erected, showcasing the era's architectural prowess. Islamic art, with its intricate geometric patterns and calligraphy, flourished. Literature thrived with poets and writers such as Al-Mutanabi and Al-Farabi, while global trade networks connected East and West, transforming cities like Baghdad and Cairo into economic powerhouses. A spirit of tolerance and cultural exchange pervaded the Islamic caliphates, encouraging a rich exchange of ideas across religions and cultures. Technological innovations in fields like water management, agriculture and paper production revolutionized society and economy. The Golden Age of Islam had its highs and lows, with different empires like the Abbasid and Umayyad caliphates contributing to its overall progress. The legacy of this period continues to shape our world, with its contributions to science, mathematics, philosophy and culture indelibly imprinted on human civilization. The Golden Age of Islam, a beacon of light that continues to illuminate paths of knowledge and discovery.